What's up guys, it's the T-Ball and I am back with another video. So today I'm going to be going over the question, are the Cleveland Cavaliers real NBA playoff contenders? So before I start, if you want to see more daily NBA content just like this, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. And also be sure to turn on post notifications so you can stay updated. All of my newest video will be coming out. So the Cavaliers have just signed Kevin Love to a 4 year, $120 million deal and it looks like they are trying to build a team around him. With LeBron James gone to LA, it looks like Kevin Love will be the Cavs main focal point. He's going to be getting an opportunity to be the main guy on a team for the first time since his days with the Minnesota Timberwolves, and it will be interesting to see how far he takes Cleveland, but are the Cavaliers real playoff contenders? Well, their team without LeBron James looks pretty bad, but not terrible. It doesn't look like a bottom 5 team at all as they have some nice pieces and veterans. Kevin Love, Kyle Korver, George Hill, Jetty Osmond, Larry Nance Jr., and others are all solid players. The Cavs also had Colin Sexton at point guard and he looked pretty solid in the summer league, though he seems to be more of a scoring guard than a distributor. The Cavs will likely be looking at a starting lineup of Colin Sexton, George Hill, Jetty Osmond or Rodney Hood depending on if Hood gets re-signed by the Cavs this offseason, Kevin Love, and Larry Nance Jr. Their bench would consist of Jordan Clarkson, Kyle Korver, J.R. Smith, and Tristan Thompson or Ante Zizic getting the backup 5 minutes. It's not a bad team at all, and it looks like they could compete with a lot of teams in the NBA. But will it lead to wins? Well, I think that's going to be a struggle. I expect them to be a pretty energetic team and keep games close, but I think their lack of a truly good closer like LeBron James will hurt them when the games get tight. Kevin Love will try his best to score and close out games, but I think he'll have trouble having defensive mainly target him. It's going to be a pretty big adjustment for Love to be back to the number one option on a team, as he was used to LeBron James or Kyrie Irving when Irving was with the Cavs, getting most of the defensive attention. Overall, I think the Cavs will be likely looking at a 35 win season, and I think they'll be in the playoff race for the majority of the season. But I don't think they have enough talent to make it to the playoffs without LeBron James, even in a top heavy Eastern Conference. They're going to be very fun to watch, and they'll definitely be competing with teams night in and night out. But unless Colin Sexton has a Donovan Mitchell type rookie season, the Cavs don't have enough talent on both sides of the floor to make it to the playoffs. But I do hope they do make it, as it will be a great story for the Cavs to still be a good team even after LeBron's departure. In reality, I don't think it's too likely, and there may be a chance the next offseason, Kevin Love may be traded for assets. I'll be doing a more in-depth analysis on the Cavaliers 2018-19 season when I do my previews and predictions for all NBA teams, so be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for that. But to answer the question if the Cleveland Cavaliers are real NBA playoff contenders, I think they will be playoff contenders for a little bit, but eventually their lack of talent will take them out of the playoff race. So that's a wrap, thanks guys for watching, if you guys did enjoy this video and want to see more daily NBA content just like this, be sure to drop a like and subscribe and also be sure to turn on post notifications so you can stay updated on when my newest video will be coming out. Also follow me on Instagram and hit me up if you want to talk about basketball, business or have any video ideas you want me to do, let me know as I do try to get back to all you guys there. Drop a comment down below if you think the Cleveland Cavaliers are real NBA playoff contenders and how many wins you think they'll have, let me know down in the comments below. As I do read all comments and I'll definitely try to get back to most of you guys there as well. So once again, thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you guys soon for my next video. Peace.